On today's gameplay, I check out Box One, a solo game designed by Neil Patrick Harris, available at Target. Those are all very odd words, and so it will also be odd when I tell you that I've played literally thousands of games, and Box One might be the most unique board game I've ever played. Like, for real. Let's check it out. <laughs> What does that even mean, Bowers Game Corner? Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again for another gameplay video, another special solo gameplay video. And today I'm very excited to be checking out Box One, a game for one created by one, presented by Neil Patrick Harris. Come along on the ride with me. Hey friend, it's your friendly friend, Neil Patrick Harris. I hope you're alone and excited to challenge yourself because you're about to dive deep into my crazy new game, Box One. You'll be using all the items you find inside to complete the Box One challenge. Are you by yourselves right now? Seriously, are you all? Are you? Okay, great. This game involves a series of challenge cards that you need to play in order. Follow every instruction strictly and keep your eyes peeled as you never know when this game might take a turn. Use the notepad and pen to jot down any thoughts or clues that you may discover along the way. Feel free to consult the internet for any help you may need. To begin, find the black envelope in the game box. It contains an important message inside. Read it now. After that, open the box of challenge cards and read the first card. If you truly get stuck, get a hint. And I don't have a device, so we're going to be in some trouble. So here we go, inside this right here. So let's open it up, and spoilers are about to happen. Let's do it. You will need this card later. <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. Meet me at the top. So I don't know if you can see that. Meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. And then there's... Some numbers down there. Okay. Uh, I'm going to write down those numbers just, just for maybe some help a little bit later. Because, you know, it would be nice to have them. 23, 10, 16, 14, minus. And then these ones, yeah, okay, so those are commas. 21, 13, 7, and 22. So that's the first clue we got going right there. You will need this card later. Okay, so we open this, and we look at box number one, and we are on our way. Challenge cards. All right. Number one. All right. Welcome to card number one of box one. Prepare to take a journey like never before in this ever-evolving game of trivia, puzzles, riddles, and cryptic codes. I really hope that you are the one to successfully complete box one. You must follow all of my instructions very carefully. Now take a deep breath. I'm assuming I just wrote one of the card too. This is not just a breathing game. All right. And let it out. Okay. Now, you can go back to breathing normal. Did you just do that? Fantastic. Just a simple test to see if you're good at following directions. All right. I take a deep breath. Let it out. We're going to follow it strictly to a T because it's Neil Patrick. Come on. All right. Now take the card from the black envelope and put it in your freezer and leave it there. Seriously, you have to do it. Once you've done that, come back and keep playing. Okay, well, I will be back in a second. Do, 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 do. Okay. What next, Neil? What next? All right, now take the card from the black envelope Put it in your freezer and leave it there. Seriously. Okay. Once you've done that, come back and keep playing. All right. What do we got? Stop. The next card is super important. Okay. Proceed when ready. <sighs> okay. I will proceed. Now, make sure you play all the cards right underneath me in order. Okay? Ready, set, go. Let's do it. Using the capital letters from the previous card, solve this. Blank is the capital of what country? Now, make, so this is using the capital letters from the previous card. Solve this. Now, make sure you play all the cards right. So we got P, A, R, S. Is there an I we're missing somewhere? P, A, R, I, S. Paris. Okay. Paris is the capital of what country? 
Um, I don't know. We're going to cheat here, by the way, because that's just the nature of this. And I don't have something. I'm not going to be looking on the device. What is the capital of what country? Paris is the capital of what country? Uh, France. It's France, right? Yeah, it's France. Wait, so what? Does it, how do I know if I'm right? I don't know. France, I guess? What is the most famous landmark in that country? Okay. Okay. It's the Eiffel Tower. All right. You're making feel... You know, look at me. I'm so clever. Yeah, you're stringing me along. I'm waiting to be fooled. What is the famous... So it's Eiffel Tower. These are numbered for some reason, and famous is circled. So I feel like that's going to be important later on and let's let's see what i got on the camera space so i want to make sure that everything is going where we need it to go all right use the letters in a specific order from the previous answer to complete this quote there is nothing so important as okay there is nothing so important as so eiffel tower so t 11 o w e r R two uh, I three would be F six would be L trifle one would be E <laughs> trifles. There's nothing so important as trifles. Who said this? I don't know who said that. <laughs> I got no clue. Uh, so this is where I would totally cheat, but I don't have the internet, so I'm not going to cheat. We're just going to pretend like I did. His most popular character was blank. Now, is there a way that I would be able to figure this out? I don't know. All right. Am I doing this? Am I grabbing the phone? Are we going on this adventure the right way? Let's do it. All right. All right, Neil. You got my phone. You got 55%. Let's do it. So, uh, what was the last question? His most popular character was blank. Most. Eight. There's nothing so important as trifle. Who said this? So, we're going to Google search this. Should we bing it? I think we'll Google search it. <laughs> there is... Nothing so important as, here we go, there is nothing so important as trifle, but there is nothing so important as trifles. It is, of course, a trifle, but Arthur Conan Doyle. So who said that? Arthur Conan Doyle. All right. Now, I know that is a person. I know he's, his most popular character was, uh, that's Sherlock Holmes, I do believe. Let's make sure that fits on there. S-H-E-R-L-O-C-K-H-O-L-M-E-S. Yes, Sherlock Holmes. This character had a partner in the stories whose name was Watson. Uh, and we have stories also circled right there. Interesting. Use the name from the previous answer. This female actress launched her career in a series of movies about a boy. Okay, use the name from the previous career which was Holmes so use the name from the previous answer this female actress launched her career in a series of movies about a boy named so Emma Holmes maybe I don't know this one's got me stumped all right I will do a little bit of google foo but we might have to go just straight to the answers on here because uh I don't know Emma Holmes Emma Holmes tv show Wait, so Holmes. Let's just type in Holmes, female actress. Who do we get that pops up? We got, uh, these are all, why? Uh, <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I don't do exit rooms by myself for this very reason. I'm scared to loan. Luckily, I have the internet to cheat with. So that's great. I do have the internet. So, all right. This character had a partner in the story whose name was Holmes. Use the name from the previous answer. This female actress launched her career in a series of movies about a boy named... I have no clue. We're going to go to the 
the we're gonna go to the cheat sheet and we'll actually text test that out box one game dot com slash help oh i typed in it my fingers are so sausagey all right box one no i said typed in bow one box oh this is terrible this is all going to hell. box one game yeah, slash help yes give it to me all right, the help screen is not part of the game. It is only intended to use if you're truly actually stuck and can't go on. If you're stuck, click the link below for some helpful hints. Otherwise, let's pretend like nothing happened. Proceed. I will need you. Do you need help with the challenge cards? Yes. Which one do I need help with? I need help with 11. So this is nice. You can scroll through. I need help with 11. The fictional character Watson shares the same name of the actress Emma Watson, which gives me the clue Harry Potter. This female actress there launches a career in a series of movies about a boy named Harry Potter. I was thinking, okay, so there we go. Emma Watson, very cool. He was most well known for having a blank on his forehead scar. Okay, I like how this is going. It's like a pop culture, like brain teaser quiz type thing. Answer from the previous card was the villain in what animated movie from 1994? Scar, Lion King. Look at that. I feel clever. Neil, thank you. You just made me feel clever. <laughs> when you take your opponent's last word from the previous card's answer, you win at the game of blank. Uh, Lion King was the villain in the animated movie Scar. When you take your opponent's last word from the previous card's answer, you win at the game of blank. Lion King? King? When you take your opponent's last word from the previous card's answer, King, you win the game of chess. Oh, okay. It's Lion King, chess. Gotcha. In the rules of the game from the previous card's answer, the color is always supposed to go first. I don't remember. I think it's black. I'm pretty sure it's black, but I'm not sure. It's a really old game, so it could be very. It could very well be racist. And it should, I think it's white. Who goes first in the game of chess? I know who goes first in the game of chess. <laughs> so are you going to make me Google it myself? I keep, come on, Neil. Come on, making me do extra work. Uh, Ugo's first in chess. I'm pretty sure it is white because it's a super old and racist game. Like, if you, uh, the chess of the player who's first to is white and the player who's, yes, the, it goes first. All right. Uh, so, back to that. The color white is always supposed to go first. The red house is on the white street and the blue house is on the red street. Where is the white house? It is in Washington, D.C., okay? <laughs> That's like an eight-year-old. That would My seven-year-old would give me that one. But hey, keep you on your toes, I guess. The longest answer from the previous card, the longest answer from the previous card would be uh, Washington, is found on the front of the $1 bill, okay? And they gave you just enough so that you can figure it out yourself. On the back of the $1 bill, there are words. Oh, so I like how this, you just, you, you, so you just take that and you move on to the next clue. I think that's kind of clever. All right, on the back of the $1 bill, there are words in English and in Latin. The Latin word for lapis equals what in English? No clue. So just come on, tell it to me. Don't make me Google it. So much. Feel free to consult the internet to find the trick. Why, why, why can't you just do it? Why do I have to go search? What? I understand giving me a clue to like send me in the right direction. But if I clearly don't know, just give it to me. Come on, give it to me, Neil. Latis, an ancient Celtic poly, uh, uh, an ancient name of one of the Celtic deities worshiped in Roman Britain. Uh, word for lapis equals uh, what in English? The Latin, all right, La lattice, Latin definition. Latin, this Latin to English, and Latin means side. Okay, is side. No, side is a five-letter word. Okay, flank, F-L-A-N-K. Okay, we'll go flank. Yeah, it must be flank. Okay, flank. Ooh, whoa, that card's weird. That card's weird. I'm scared. What was that? Why is that card weird? What happened? That's an E. Okay, we got some shenanigans afoot. Last word from the answer to card... Oh, gosh. Oh, God. Is she really last word from the answer to card 13. So I really need to be keeping these in order. Oh, my good gravy. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15... 
What comes out to 15 is the 16, 17, 18. All right, so here we go, and now things are getting crazy. Last word from the answer to card 13 was, answer from the previous card was the villain in the animated movie from 1994, The Lion King. All right, so last word from the answer. So King, first name from the answer to eight. So we got King, and then there's nothing so important. Who said this? Arthur Conan Doyle. First name from the answer. King Arthur pulled a sword from a stone, which is going to be Emma Stone. Cool sword. Sword it is. I should be writing on these. But I don't want to ruin it for, for someone else. I'll give this to a friend and let them do it. All right, so sword is 20. Wait, is there is there some shenanigans on here? Is there any shenanigans on here? I don't see any shenanigans. Okay. I like to see shenanigans. All right. Pull the sword from a stone. Okay. The silent letter in answer from the previous card is what number in the alphabet? The silent letter in sword uh, would be sword. It's the W. Is what number in the alphabet? So A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, R, G, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W. 23. So 23, 21 is 23. All right. So I should probably put these in order. 21 is 23. So what's 22? All right. The answer from the previous... You know what? I'm going to just... That's what we're going to do. Because I have a feeling that might come in handy at some point. Uh, I should probably start at 1, shouldn't I? <laughs> no, we'll just start at 21 because I'm a noob. So the answer to 21 is 23. The answer to 20 is sword. Okay. The answer from the previous card represents a legendary athlete with the nickname blank. Okay. Is what? Not 23. The answer from the previous card represents a legendary athlete with the name uh, Michael Jordan. What? Nickname. It's 23. The answer from the previous card represents a legendary athlete with the nickname MJ, uh, the goat, the Air Air Jordan, Air Jordan, Air Michael. It's Air Michael, Air Jordan. Hopefully it won't bite us in the tail. All right, so we're going to go. When I am the first word of the answer from the previous card, which was air, uh, I am, so I am not, well, I, I, I am in air. I am not in oxygen. I am also in Neil Patrick Harris, but not in Bob Smith. I am necessary to the game, but I am not in the rules. What am I? What? <laughs> what? Okay. This is, okay, so I think this is like some sort of riddle. I am not in oxygen. Well, I am in air. I am not in oxygen. I am also in Neil Patrick Harris, but not in Bob Smith. I am necessary to the game, but I am not in the rules. Uh, no clue. <laughs> no clue on the riddles. So let's go ahead and hopefully this will just, uh, hopefully it'll give me a clue. So this is the kind of one that I want a clue on. Because I know it's some sort of riddle. Like, just send me in the right direction. You will find this letter in Air, Neil Patrick Harris, and Game, but not Oxygen, Bob Smith, or Rules. Oh, okay. While I am in Air, uh, so it's either A, I, or R, I am not in Oxygen. I am also in Neil Patrick Harris, but not in Bob Smith. I am necessary to the game, but I am not in the rules. Uh, so, it's, but what am I? Uh, air. While I am in the first word of the answer from the previous card, I am not in oxygen. I am also in Neil Patrick Harris. But, okay, so it's, it's one of the letters in air, right? But I'm not in the rules. What am I? The letter something. So 23 is going to be the letter something i got that but what would it be it's either a i r i am in i'm not in oxygen air isn't in any of those i am also in neil patrick harris a i and r are in all of those i i i actually neil patrick and harris all have i but not in bob smith bob smith does have an i so it can't be i it has to be a or r i am necessary to the game so there's an A in game, but I am not in the rules. So the letter is A. I'm also in Neil Patrick Harris. Neil Patrick Harris has an A, but not in Bob Smith. Bob Smith does not have an A, so it is the letter A. Oh, okay, cool. These are, these are working the brain. 
Answer from the previous card is also not in secret. What? Uh, the letter A is also not in secret box. Uh, so it's not in secret box. What? NPH has an answer from the previous card. NPH has a secret. Continue by using the clues in the cards below. And Neil Patrick Harris. <laughs> so it's secret. Ooh, box one. What's under here? Oh, you got the shenanigans! There's the shenanigans! Okay. I like it. I like it. This is like a magic thing. That's awesome. Okay. What is this? What? What? Okay. Continue by using the clues in the cards below. Um... Okay, what does this say? Okay. Hello, if you are reading this, thank you already. My name is Martin Maloney. I can't say much now, but Neil has kidnapped me and I need your help. I created a pair of keys inside the stack of challenge cards you just played. You will need to use those torn key cards to access a secret compartment inside this game. Remove the black plastic tray from the game box. Locate... The three keyholes underneath. What? There were shenanigans in the box. I didn't even notice them when I unboxed it. You got me. And push. All right. All right. So uh, here's what we're doing. I created a pair of keys inside the stack of challenge cards. So those were the weird wonky ones with the things going on. What? 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 Boom. Yes. Okay. Okay. So a pair of keys. Uh, I created a pair of keys inside the stack of challenge cards you just played. You will need to use those torn key cards to access a secret compartment inside the game. Remove the black plastic tray from the game box. Locate the three keyholes. Wait, there's keyholes. What? What? There's keyholes under here? No. I create a pair of keys inside the stack of challenge cards you just played in to access the secret compartment inside the game. Remove the black plastic tray from the game box. Locate the three keyholes underneath. Insert the keys and push. Okay. Uh, here we go. So these go... right. Oh, so you use them like this to apply pressure and pop that... Oh, you... You with the shenanigans... I like it, and now, okay, okay, I was, I was unimpressed with my unboxing, but now we have an envelope, and I'm impressed by envelopes, and a, a floppy, we got a floppy, a thick floppy, peanut butter cup, loyalty card, okay, cool, and what's going on here, nothing else secret in there, oh, 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 okay, nothing getting, nothing getting past me, what do we got here? It's a charity's fortune. A dubious friend may be an enemy in camouflage. Lucky numbers. Okay. What's going on? Go through all the clues to find the next step. The key lies in this note. Combine and chain the clues to navigate this web of mystery. The proposed site is found by folding this clue. Oh, man. I'm not good at this sort of stuff. We will see how this goes. All right, what do we got in here? We got some interesting stuff. We have, wow, that's really good. Box one. That is, that is metal. That is, hat. ooh, it's a decoder ring. Drink rich chocolate Ovaltine. Martin Maloney, Chief Innovation Officer. Okay, it's a thumbprint. What have we gotten ourselves into? All right, so let's get the, wait, 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 is this, there's stuff, okay, so yeah, okay. Let's get to the last card. Okay, so we, we we are where we need to be. So let's try and figure this out. I created a pair of keys inside the stack of challenge cards. Remove the black plastic tray from the game. Uh, good luck, I'm counting on you. That's it, that's all we got. Go through all the clues to find the next step. The key lies in this note. Combine and chain the, let's see, what happens if I just do this? Wait, uh, does it say something? It feels like it has capitals right there. Maybe E V D clues Vigate. No, no. Okay, let's see. What is the disc? What's this disc? I mean, 
Is there something, some secret slot? <laughs> it's not like an actual disc. I'm trying to slide it. It's like a, it's like a pop off. Hmm. Oh, what, you, what secrets do you hold? I can't move it. I don't want to break it. <laughs> I mean, obviously, I could just smash the dang thing in half. But I feel like that would be against the spirit of the game. All right. We got this. We got that. I don't know what any of this means. We are going to need to phone a friend. Let's get a clue. Let's go. Card number. Challenge cards after number 25. Uh, found inside this special block of cards, you will find a handwritten note from Martin Maloney, part of a decoding tool, and a staff ID keychain. Read the note from Martin carefully using the pair of oddly shaped keys made from the small challenge cards together will help you with this next step. What? Okay. Read the note from Martin carefully using the pair of oddly shaped letters. Uh, huh. The, no, this couldn't be it. That doesn't make, that seems really difficult. <laughs> go through, go, th maybe, maybe this. Oh, uh, no. Hmm. Go through all. Well, no, of course it's going to look like it's spelling something. It's actually trying to spell something. To find the keychain, web of mystery. Go through all the clues to find the next step. The key lies in this note. Combine and chain the clues to navigate this web of mystery. The proposed site is found by folding this clue. Uh, uh, don't can I can I get can I get can I get uh, can I take this out? I imagine E equals zero. I don't know if that helps me. I don't know what that means. Might come up later. This is this is nice three D printing. <laughs> okay, maybe <sighs> let me read that. I, I am stuck. Key cards. All right. So oh, but but I keep going down. It gives me a clue. Good. Challenge cards number nineteen and twenty four. When lined up in place, we'll create a rigged key. Take out the plastic black tray from the bottom part of the actual game box. Underneath that tray are three keyholes. Uh, did you line up the key cards with the keyholes and push gently? A secret compartment containing a black envelope will be revealed. There's send and uh, what? <laughs> the big black envelope. Hid inside a black envelope in a secret compartment inside the game box tray, you will discover four new items. Fortune, cookie slip, Got it. Oh, yeah. I should, maybe that's important. Oh. Your lucky numbers are... They, I bet they're these. Oh. Oh, okay. Maybe we don't need this yet. Let's, uh, let's, let's actually look at all the clues before we, before we keep reading here. You know, I want to try and do this 80. Wait, 80? Oh, you suck. 329. Okay, my hope is dashed. But let's still see if it's... There's no 29. <laughs> They're stinky, dumb, stinky. All right, whatever. All right, hidden inside a black envelope in the secret apartment so that you discover four new items. Everything you found hidden inside the game box will be important. Start with the small handwritten note found in the black envelope with the words facing up so you can read the note. Fold it along the dotted line to the left, leaving only some of the words exposed. Follow these directions. What? Oh, ooh, oh, go to Keychain website. Oh, I see you. Okay, like it? Like it? All right, Keychain website. What is the Keychain website? Is this the box presented by Neil Patrick Harris? What's the Keychain website? Oh, oh, this is the keychain. That's the website. Ha, 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 ha. Keychain website. It literally means the keychain's website. <laughs> All right. N P H games dot com slash staff. Okay, okay. Let's go. Ooh, employee name. Password, log in. This is cool. This is cool. Let me let me get this in focus so you can kind of see what's going on here. But that's uh that's very neat. That is that's cool. All right, what do we got though? Can I fingerprint scan? Log in. Employee name. Um password. I don't know. 
help. The help screen is not part of the game. If you're stuck, click the link below for some helpful hints. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um, that's odd. So I have no idea. Oh, so it's Martin. All right, Martin. Maloney. All right, Martin Maloney, Chief Innovation. And we need his password. Thumbprint identification reveals this shape. Hint. Thumbprint identification reveals this shape. What does that mean? I feel like there's a tiny little thing engraved in there. Like ever so slightly, but I can't see what it is. It's like 47, maybe? 47? That's not a password. You know how to do 47. That's not right. <laughs> All right, but we'll try it. We'll try it out. 47. You gonna take my password? Nope. <laughs> They said no. We won't take your password. We just won't even. We we won't, won't even acknowledge that you put in a password. All right. So what do we need to do next? Uh, we're here. The website. This reveals the shape. No clue what this means. Hmm. Okay. So we are. Wait. Is this the thumbprint reader? Is this a thumb? I thought there's a floppy disk. Maybe this is like a secret thumbprint reader. Something like that. I don't know. I don't know with Neil Patrick Harris now. There was a mystery compartment, and I am thrown off my element, Donnie. All right, so we actually need the regular version of the help. All right, key cards. Challenge cards after two key cards. The big black envelope. Keychain. Read through this, send NPN, what, why would I have to send you a message? No, I don't want to have to send you a message, I'm shooting a video. <laughs> no way. Take out the back, line up the key cards with the keyholes, the big black, are they really going to send me somewhere to do this? With the words facing up. Okay, so I got to the website, the website, I couldn't figure out the website, so... Let's go back to the website. No, let's go back to the website. No, 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 stupid phone. Okay. So we're going to the website. Where is the website? Okay, here we go. Uh, so message here for assistance. What? They want me to send an email? What the hell? Are you kidding me? Set What? They want you to send an email if you get stuck. How? Uh, okay, that's 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 not good. <laughs> a dubious friend may be an enemy in camouflage. Lucky numbers 12, 17, 83, 29, 89. Maybe that's, maybe that's my password? Maybe, I don't know. Grasping at straws here? Grasping at straws. It's 12... No way. Well, I mean, maybe he had that there as his thing. 80, 3, 29, 89. There's not enough spaces. Ah, oh, it's not the password. Login. No. Thumbprint identification reveals this shape. So it's a shape. Diamond. Oval. Uh, thumbprint reveals this shape rectangle oh my gosh it's a rectangle <laughs> okay maybe let's try this out but i do have to clear everything out in here which is super annoying that also is just because my phone is a piece of garbage yes rectangle let's rectangle the key no <laughs> uh this this video might end rather abruptly e C. Rick. Tangle. A. R E C T A N G L. No, it's not rectangle. Rectangle. It's it's not an oval. Thumbprint identification 
reveals this shape. And it's R-E-C-T-A-N-G. So it can't be rectangle because it has to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight letters. What what shape has eight letters? Circle, square, triangle, rectangle, oval. Um MPH games. This is this is not good. <laughs> this is not how this should end. This is not a fun way to end this. But this appears to be maybe there's something that I'm missing. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna try this out. I'm gonna really try and figure this out and I look at the hints one more time. But this is not going well. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a little gogurt. That'll settle me down. That'll settle me down. All right. So um, maybe we just have to break this. Maybe you just do have to break it. Maybe that's the thing. No, it doesn't slide open. There's got to be some secret way to get this thing to do some stuff. Maybe it's a magnet. Maybe there's a magnet in here. Magnets in play? No. No magnet. E equals zero. Is this a sticker? E equals zero. Zero. Uh, rectangle. No, that wouldn't work. Zero equals three. Box one, presented by Neil Patrick Harris. Theory two. Oh, maybe this. Maybe this decoder. Maybe we have to decode something. Maybe we have to decode. No, the 89 would still not work because there's not 89 now. <laughs> Nope, not helpful. There's something maybe smudged there. I don't know if that's potentially it's cool components. Good sense of mystery. Maybe uh maybe the thumb pen is helpful at all. Nope, nope. So I am stuck. And uh, I will try one more time, but I do believe that this is gonna be the end of the video because I can't get through this part right here. And uh, the, the website is not going to help me out. And they want me to send them an email. That's not generally how most gameplay videos go. Oh, how did it end? Oh, he ended up stopping <laughs> and uh, sending an email to the company. Do you need help with the challenge cards? No. Do you need help with the NPH game staff account? No. Do you need help with the NPH security? No. Then what the heck for you alone? What? Uh, I don't. I already bought it. I have buyer's remorse. Do you need help with the challenge cards? Oh, come on, come on, come on, man. Do you, yes, I do need help with the challenge cards. Then. Okay. Big black envelope, keychain, keychain, and now you've gone through and discovered many secret components in your game box. Of all the items, there's only one item with a very logical stump. Look at the NPH game staff ID keychain. This is Martin Malley's staff ID keychain. Try visiting that website, which I did. I don't know what to do, and I'm not having fun. <laughs> like, I want to have fun. I I want to, like, be spanked instead of saying, oh, you're dumb. Here's what you need to do, but you can keep going. This is like, the game was like, no, we're holding you back. You don't get to go to 11th grade because you can't figure out how to unlock the website with Martin O'Malley's key password. Like, seriously, this is not this is not how games are supposed to end. And, um, but it is. Defeated. I've been defeated by the game. I will give it one last go. Wait, wait, what? What is this? What? What? Congratulations. You have mastered and completed box one. Welcome to the club. Oh, I welcome to the club. Forget you. I cheated. I cheated my way into it. <laughs> you have entered and completed box one. Welcome to the club. To confirm your completion, go to this website address, keep top secret, and passcode. Oh, well, well you know what? This is spoilerific, so I guess we're doing this. This is going down uh, by hook or by crook, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what will we get on this website? <laughs> Hopefully, it'll be a little bit more user-friendly than the last one. Uh, so let's see. NPH Games 
dot com slash oh, numbers two seven one eight nine one eight nine. All right, let's go. What do we got? Stop. Only continue if you're sure you've reached the very end of box one. If you're not yet at the end, come back to this website later as a final last step. Well, here's the thing, game. I want to not be done, but you know what? I'm going to pry that open. Okay, we pried it open. You know what? <laughs> the adventure continues, but I'm sure there was supposed to be some sort of way that we were supposed to do that that wasn't so uh, barbaric, perhaps? I don't know. Or maybe I was. Maybe I just need to stop being a softy. We got our disc. We got our thing. Oh, okay. Looky there. Looky, looky. Who's got a cookie? Maybe you had a little note. How to use decoder. Place the two decoder pieces together. You'll discover cipher codes hidden throughout the game. Line up outer ring letters with inner ring letters from the cipher codes. Replace each letter from the coded message with new letters found on the decoder ring. All right. Cipher codes hidden throughout the game. Line up cipher codes. So where are some cipher codes hidden throughout the game? Maybe these ones that... Hmm. Replace... Each letter from the coded message with new letters found on the decoded ring. So we line it up like so. How do, like how do you how do you know it's lined up the right way though? Um, like that, I guess. Is that how it works? I think that's how it works. Maybe, but the fact that it moves makes it extra confusing. All right, so I think that's what it is. You'll discover cipher codes hidden throughout the game. Line up the outer ring letters with inner ring letters from the cipher codes. Replace each letter from the coded message with new letters found on the decoder ring. Okay, so what are some of the cipher words we found, I guess? Any words that are, like, terribly out of the ordinary? Oh, we have the freezer thing. We have the freezer thing. What's in the freezer? Okay, okay. Oh. Meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. Okay. Meet me at the top hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. Staff live chat. Okay. So I need to be logged in in order to do that, though. And once again, we're not logged in. Ah, oh, staff live. Maybe, maybe the staff. Maybe the staff. There's help. Maybe that help. Oh, maybe the help is the staff. Do you need help with the challenge cards? No. Do you need help with the NPH game staff account? Maybe that's it. <coughs> Uh, no, this is not, <laughs> maybe this is not it, logging in. Oh, oh, it is! Dude, okay, so this is a game, they're, they want you to fail. They want you to get a sense of satisfaction. Whew, this, I gotta take a pause here. I've never played a game that actively wanted me to lose before. And I like that. <laughs> Like, just to find this, I had to... Ooh, that's interesting. Logging in. Look uh, for the name found on the staff ID. Password. Locate the thumbprint found on the back of the staff ID. And these are clues that I'm sure if I were smarter, I could figure out already. Where's our thing? Where's our thing? There it goes. Okay. Using the heat from your thumb, rub back and forth in the middle of the thumbprint. You will find what you're looking for. The eight-letter password is the shape you discovered hidden under the thumbprint? What? Okay. It's a triangle. 
It's a triangle. I thought it was a weird 47. Let me see if I can zoom in on this for you. There's the triangle. Wow. Okay. I'm back on board. You lost me, but now I'm back. Let's go. Triangle. Okay. We, we still have the mystery website already pulled up, so we're guaranteed. We're playing house money now. Yeah, you like that. You don't like house money, do you, Neil? I'm on house money mode. No matter what, I'm revealing that winner thing. All right, so we're here. We're in staff chat, email, documents, video chat. So this is interesting. Uh, meet me at the top of the hour. Wait, was that? Meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. Uh, email. So what am I trying to do here? Oh, go through all the clues to find the next step. The key lies in this note. Combining channels to clues. Web mystery. The post site is found is holding this clue. Uh, we got a decoder. Inbox. Back to mailboxes. Sent. Okay. Here we go. We're, we're, there's stuff. There. Okay. Notepad and pen. So I thought we should include the notepad and pen. After thinking about it, it just makes the most sense. Plus, we'll make it look really nice. We could even put your logo on that pen. Send by Martin Maloney's home phone. Marty, adding the pen and notepad is going to make the big game box bigger. Think that'll be an issue? I don't know if there are many trivia games that include a pen and paper pad. These are things people usually have lying around at home. Sent by NPH. Neil, so I'm thinking just the trivia cards in a box is going to look small. We should add something else, just like pen or paper or something. <laughs> this, this seems like a very real email. Uh, okay, so... what? Sent. Uh, trivial? This message has no content. Game component alts. What is this? Uh... Neil, Martin, um, I know you poo pooed the idea of the 20 cent die. I want to reintroduce that. I think that there's a lot of possibilities that we can have this be kind of a one man RPG. You know, we can really get into it. A lot of decision points. I know it's it's a it's a different direction than we were going in, but I really think I just had this idea. Call me back. Okay, <laughs> that's that's really interesting. Any other ideas? Need something really amazing that other games don't have? Secret boxes, loaded dice, anything sent from NPH? No, loaded die. That would be cool. Okay, so how about a puzzle box or something that looks like uh, one thing but is actually something totally different? The player can slide the walls of the box and it opens in a special way to reveal a skeleton key. Too complicated? No. <laughs> no, there's nothing in this box. Get out of here. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Maybe, 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 maybe. Wait, wait, wait. Something's, something feels weird. In there. What do we got? O-M-G. What is this? Sometimes the brightest ideas emerge in the blink of an eye, or in this case, the snap of a flash on the inside box lid. Cipher password. You will find, what in the, what in the, oh my gosh, what is going on here? This is, okay, I take it all back. There's so many tricks. There's so much up this game's sleeve. I like that. Oh my gosh. I think I ripped it, but hey, what else? Oh, okay, what else? All right. Whoa, wowzers. This was not what I was expecting at all. Uh, let's let's zoom the camera out just a little wee bit. And holy guacamole. So that is... Sometimes the brightest idea is, I told you that you will need this later. Well, now is the time. You must hold it up to a bright light to continue. Uh... Uh, now it's like becoming unwieldy. Uh, okay, I can read it. Meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. Listen to the voicemail from March 29th, 2019. So, oh, these are steps. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, all right, so we listen to the voicemail. First thing, all right. Voicemail, video chat, video archives. I don't have voicemail. <laughs> help. <laughs> I don't want... No, I don't want to go back to this help. <laughs> Staff chat. 
Okay, it's, it's almost the top of the hour in 19 minutes. Got to keep my eyes on that. No, I don't want to go back to this. How do I go forward? <laughs> there we go, forward. There we go. Uh, photos, video chat, documents, staff chat. No, I did that. Email. Let's just keep going through the email. Maybe there's something that we missed. Key code idea. Hey, Neil, picking up that conversation about using a cipher for something, I attached a few noise memo with another thought. Let me know what you think. Is this one we already listened to? Should we end up using pin codes, four digits or six digits? These look like actual like back and forth emails, uh, which I do like. I think that adds to the theme of the game a good deal. All right, so documents. Let's check that out. Notepad artwork. Okay, spider webs. Just as a spider spins its web, connect these clues to let me out. Freedom will be quite a sight. That's odd. Website. Just as a spider spins its web and sight. Oh, so this is going to be... Uh, okay. Photos. USA. But there's... Weird. Okay. It looks like barbed wire. Box one. Fancy pen. Oh, it'll reveal that. Okay, cool. Video chat, what do we got here? <laughs> this is so absurd, I love it. It doesn't, maybe it doesn't work. I mean, my phone's just bad. Hey dude, just wanted to touch base, check in, uh, I got your notes on the challenge cards, and uh, I had a look at it, and I uh, applied them, so let me know what you think, and uh, let's catch up this weekend. Hey buddy, no worries about missing coffee yesterday, I totally understand. Um, yeah, and lo loving that you like the challenge cards, though. That's great news. Uh, I actually put a lot of fun work into trying to figure out what the missing object could be that you wanted hidden through the game. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, if you could just, uh, you know, when you get a chance, uh, give me some notes. Let me know what you think. Love to see something on paper. So, all right. Take care. <laughs> How many of these are they going to be, I wonder? sign off on the challenge cards and secret object i know it's been a week uh and you've been busy but uh really need to get those notes in before we go to print so any thoughts you have would be really appreciated okay cool Ooh, this is interesting <laughs> I am so confused and I love it. Hey Neil, I sent over the list of all you wanted, including the pen idea you liked. Um, just need to know what you think is best ASAP. Kind of starting to feel like I'm working on this game by myself a little bit. Um, anyhow, any feedback would be really, really appreciated. So, Anything at all, okay? Thanks, man. <laughs> it just keeps spiraling downward. I, wait, no, 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 I don't want to miss one. Neil, Earth to Neil. It's been three weeks since you responded to my emails or texts. Just need to know what's going on, buddy. Get back to me.
hours here at the facility and I just would like some direction from you as to when I'll be returning to my normal hours and also when I can leave. Also, it doesn't really feel like it's our game anymore. It feels kind of like I'm stuck here doing all the work and you're bossing everyone around. Yeah, just get, get, get back to me as soon as you can. This is this is like an interactive experience. This is, this is not a board game right now. This is an interactive experience. It, this is something completely different, which is what I always want in board games. I don't know if I love it yet, but I know I love the idea of it. Hey, Martin, it's Neil. Um, got your message. Uh, don't know what to tell you, man. Um, I think you need to chill out a little bit, to be honest. This is a big game. I work really hard on this. And I know you have too, and it's crunch time. What? There are, there are nuanced characters in this game, but it's it's so meta. Like what? Hey, um, hey Neil, I, I'm sending this message from the factory, and I just spoke to the security guard, and he said that I'm not allowed to leave temporarily. And he's also said that it was under your orders. So, just wanted to clear that up. Hoping that's some kind of massive miscommunication. And uh, okay. So I'll uh, talk soon. All right, very soon. <laughs> okay, we took a turn. Access denied. That was okay. If you watch my channel, I have I have played quite literally thousands of games. That was one of the most interesting and engrossing things I have ever done in a board game that very moment right there <laughs> so hats off already now hopefully i can figure out what the heck else is going on but wow just fascinating video archive do not open oh password i don't remember my password it was triangle yeah it was triangle because that's what was revealed yeah triangle come on baby hit my lucky numbers oh oh chinese food baby what's the lucky numbers all right 12, 7, 83, 29, 89. Go. If you're watching this, thank you for making it this far. Please don't give up. My name is Martin Loney. And I need you to know that Neil and I are the original co-creators of <laughs> Box One was a game we created together. It was the best game we ever made. So one day I asked him if we could find a release for the public. That's when he cracked my face. He said, Why would I? We don't have to share this. I never want to share a game right. <laughs> when I came to work the next day, I found out all the codes, the doors were changed, all the passwords were different, and I was locked inside. To make this game better, I have no way to contact the outside world, so I have to get creative. I've hidden clues inside your game box. I can't risk telling you everything on here, but use the props in front of you and the clues hidden in my staff account. You're alone, and I'm the only person who can help you. I'm counting on you. Please. Reference challenge cards will chat soon. Okay, interesting. That's cool. Let's see, we go through the factory. I do have a meeting, the staff meeting on the back of the 
frozen card. Gotta make sure I hit two. This is just boxes. Okay. Uh, box one, final production. That's what I was just looking at. Box lids. This is really cool. This is like behind the scenes making in the factory, but at the same time, it's it's part of the game and it only adds to the theme of the game because these would realistically be archive videos that you wouldn't really need. Okay. <laughs> I don't think any of these are helpful, but... Uh, still fascinating nonetheless. Uh, help trash. What's in the trash? Box one prototype. Oh, do we already look in the trash? I think we already looked in the trash. Decoder. Okay. Oh, there's another video. <laughs> it's just a picture of Neil Patrick Harris. They're really nice. Man, I would, wow, that is such a nice shirt. I don't know how much that shirt costs. All right. Oh, look at the shirt again. Yeah, it just pops. All right, what's up? Um, <laughs> what do we got? N P H S S S. Oh wow. That's that's really clever. <laughs> okay. That's cool. This is neat. I'm going on the journey. We're going on the journey. N, so. N, P, H, S, S, 3091987. Okay, what does that mean? The mystery gets deeper. N, P, N, H, H, S, S. Printing press, MP4. It's just a... Hey, I used to work in a factory that did something very similar to that. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Okay, start. Is there anything to start? I already run through all these, right? Documents, photos, video chat, staff chat. Okay, so we go to the staff chat. <coughs> okay, so what does it say? Uh, meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. What is the second key? So the lucky numbers. We already got the lucky numbers. We used that. We have this. <coughs> we have this, which, to be quite frank, I'm not actually sure if we're supposed to have. This is the voicemail from March 29th, 2019. Yeah, I can't get to those voicemails. So something something different is going to happen. We have to get to the actual top of the hour. Can I, can I change the time? Can I just make it that? Email documents, photo, video chat. Okay, let's... <clears throat> I guess we just... Am I actually just going to sit here for five minutes? No, I'm going to read this. All right. Look inside the bottom of the card holder. The bottom of the card holder had uh, this clue right there. E equals zero. Oh, oh, E equals zero. That's uh, equals zero. Uh-huh. A lot of ease. I told you that you will need this later. Well, now is the time. You must hold it up to a bright light to continue. All right, I'm going to hold this up to a bright light, like a super bright light, and we're going to see what happens. Sorry, I can't do it on camera because there's not a bright light. It says B equals L. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Look at those shenanigans. I don't know if you can even see it. I, don't know, I, I, I doubt it'll work, but it says B equals l we are we look like charlie from <laughs> it's always said e equals o all right here we go okay this is this is helping wait what time is it i gotta keep my eye on the staff time now i love this i'm, I'm like actively like i gotta keep my eye on the staff time at the top of the hour so what wait, that's the actual time the actual time oh my gosh the time in this watch is my actual time. That's craziness. Cheers, Neil. Cheers. I was skeptical. Uh, uh Okay, so. N-E. Since so they're never eat shirt, wait, so it's northeast, south, 
west it's a compass uh i told you so e equals l we got that written down 1257 place sure so then we have sometimes the brightest ideas emerge in the blink of an eye or in this case the snap of a flash on the inside box lid a snap of the flash oh 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 i see there's there's like a very very faint something here which if you flash it with a camera and i can't do it because it says j equals is that a j equals a wow is that right well, I, you know what, what did I just, no, I don't have anything to possibly do to use a flash of a camera except for, the, you know, this camera right here in front of me. What a dummy. What a dummy. Okay, let's turn on the flash. Boom, take a picture. Uh, so what's the picture? It says you equals something. The flash was not bright. <laughs> My phone is so bad. I can't even play Neil Patrick Harris's game. U equals A. Oh, there it is. There I saw it. Look at that. No, U equals A. That is that is so clever. That is, and this is what I like. I love U equals A. I love an escape room style games like this, where there's more than one thing that, that's going on at a time. I really do like that. Uh, all right, so get back to where we were. Can't run out of time. 12.58, top of the hour, staff chat. Can't miss it. What happens if I did miss it? Does this game just go like an extra hour? Get, should I try and break the game? No, I'm not going to try and break the game. You will find this key on my desk in my room. Place Sherlock Holmes face down in this room. Sherlock Holmes face down in this room. I don't know what any of this stuff means, <clears throat> but it is Sherlock Holmes. That was... And now, now I'm like all paranoid. What's inside the box? What what else shenanigans is going on in here? Sherlock Holmes. Is that are those two clues that will go together? Is this let me place this like right here somehow? Hmm. Face? I don't know. Wait, uh, wait, it's face. Face? I don't know. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh, what is going on? Top of the hour. Let's go get into chat. Staff chat. Boom. Martin is online. He said, Oxygen Stories Blue Win. What does that mean? What should I be doing? I've already won. House Money. Don't forget we're playing with House Money. <laughs> Where was... What's the next clue? Oh, it was over here. Oh, no. It was, uh, it was, it was on the Frozen card. Where's the Frozen card? Where's the Frozen card? We'll need this card later. Okay. Meet me at the top of the hour on the staff live chat. You will need the second key. 2310 uh, Oxygen Stories Blue Win. The second key. What is the second key? 2310 These don't have numbers. 2310-1614. Oh, I will need the secret key. Which is 23, 10, 16, 14. But I have to look at the cards because all these numbers are low enough. The Chinese food numbers were too high. These nine numbers are not too high. Okay. <laughs> okay. 23, 10, 16, 14. All right. So that is the first part of it. 23, 10, 16, 14. And then we have 21, 13. 17, 22. So 21, 13, 7, 22. Okay, okay, okay. There's no 7 here. I must have misplaced that one, but it'll come up. 7, okay. So what do we got? 21, 13, 7, 22. Okay, so this is the code. Uh, I am not an oxygen. What am I? The letter... Uh, what was it? The letter A? It was the letter A, I think. <laughs> All right. Uh, yes, but I'm not in the rules. Yeah, okay. So the letter A, 23, 10. Whose character had a partner in the stories whose name was Holmes? A Holmes. 
home a the letter a homes washington dc chess uh that <laughs> doesn't make a dang list of sense the letter a Holmes, no, Watson, the letter A, Watson, Washington, D.C., chess, the letter, okay, that doesn't make sense right now to me, let's try 2113722, uh, the silent letter in blank is what number in the alphabet, 23, Wait, 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 what? Whoa, 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 whoa. These all have circled, circled on them. Oxygen Stories, Blue Win. This one, Silent Movie, Famous Athlete. Silent Movie, Famous Athlete. Uh, okay. And it says, you will need the second key. What is the second key? What does that mean? Uh, okay, so Oxygen Stories Blue Win. The second key uh, would be, I guess, I just type in 23. What was the name of the animated movie from Lion King? No, 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 it's not that. It's not that. Uh, oh, oh, I got this all mixed up. It is Silent. Movie Famous Athlete. So I wonder if there is a silent movie famous athlete that I need to know the name of. Silent movie famous athlete. Martin is typing. That is so cool! This is we're breaking the fourth wall, baby! Finally, it's working. Are you alone? Yes. I should just send a thumb emoji. <laughs> Whatever that would let me do it. I'm going to try to do that. Okay. Now that I know you are ready to help me, I need some time to prepare. Wait at least 24 hours and meet me here on the chaff staff tomorrow at the top of the hour. In the meantime, try to access the code breaker I hid inside the floppy disk. Study the instructions I wrote for you. What? Meet me in 24 hours? I'll run out of gigabytes <laughs> on my memory. Uh, Martin, sometimes Neil checks in on me here. If he does, I may have to cover my tracks tomorrow when you come back. If you see that I type the four code words from above, please respond with the word octagon. So I know it's you. I can't say much more, so bring everything with you tomorrow and make sure to come alone. Bye for now. Are we, are we serious right now? Did this just happen? Did this just happen? This is... This is, this is, this is, this is not a board game. This is something entirely different. This is a whole different beast. Now that I know you are ready to help me, I need some time to prepare. Wait at least 24 hours and meet me here on the staff chat tomorrow at the top of the hour. So I'm assuming I can come back any hour. <laughs> In the meantime, try to access the code breaker I hid inside the floppy disk. Study the directions I wrote from you. Sometimes Neil checks on me in here. <clears throat> if he does, I may have to cover my tracks. Tomorrow, when you come back, if you see that I type the four code words from above, please respond with the word octagon. Okay. So, if, then, octagon. Coding there. <clears throat> all caps. Oh, it's capitalized. So, all caps. O C T. A G O N. So I know it's you. I can't say much more, so bring everything with you tomorrow and make sure to come alone. Bye for now. Now that I know you are ready to help me. Uh, <clears throat> wow. So there we go. <clears throat> Part one of our journey into box one. Is completed. I have to wait 24 hours now. This was not how I expected this to end. I, I will not cheat. I will not cheat. I will not see the victory thing. But I'm tempted. You'll have to come back for video number two.
to see what that is. All right. Well, there you go. If you enjoyed what I'm doing, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. Also, in the comments below, let me know what you're thinking about this right now. I'm going to leave all of this unedited. This is just going to be the straight cut so you can see the frustration. You can see the real life like I'm about to quit this because... But the game, it's so weird. <laughs> we'll talk about it some more tomorrow. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube.